state of Jammu and Kashmir where an encounter is said to be underway at Lasipura in Pulwama. About four terrorists are said to have been killed in this encounter. So this is the latest that we are getting in terms of what is happening in the state of Jammu and Kashmir where there seems to be yet another encounter that has broken out in Pulwama. These are representative and deferred visuals that we've got on our screens. Now this part of town it is not clear as to how many of these terrorists are holed up but from the preliminary information that is coming in it appears that at least about two of these terrorists are confirmed to have been killed. All right, and for more on this, we're joined in by my colleague Ishan Vani, who's joining us from Srinagar. Good morning to you, Ishan. What is the latest on the story? Well, good morning. Uh, this operation was launched during the midnight when the forces received a tip up by the presence of these militants in Lassipura village in South Kashmir's Pulwama district. Calling with a joint team of CRPF, uh, Rashtri Rifles, a special unit of Army, and the special operation group of Virginia Kashmir police launched a searches in the area. Uh, and, uh, after hard chases, uh, there was a contact which was established between the militants and the security forces, following which uh, this encounter erupted. Uh, now remember, in this encounter, four uh, militants have been killed, and according to sources, all of the four belong to Lashkar at Taiba. Mm -hmm. uh, the is, some, is an area where Lashkar has an upper hand, and uh, you know, having four militants killed in one encounter is something which the security forces will be happy about. Uh, but right. right now, uh, the operation is still under progress. Uh, four rifles have been recovered from the scene. Uh, this is an encounter uh, which erupted early in the morning. And uh, according to sources, before the first uh, break of the dawn, uh, the bodies were actually recovered from the spot. So that means that during the overnight, all the encounter was concluded and uh, now the bodies have been recovered, and the, including the rifles and other arms and ammunition. Uh, this will be something which will be a big success for the security force, given the fact that the Lok Sabha elections are just around the corner. Mm -hmm. And South Kashmir is being seen something which is really tense uh, for the government and uh, for the other administration as well to continue and uh, to go for the elections in the, that part of Kashmir Valley. Absolutely indeed. It is going to be a huge challenge for the government, considering the fact that the elections are forthcoming. But at this point of time, do we know, Ishan, whether these are local terrorists or are these infiltrators who have come from across the border? Oh, well, uh, senior officials haven't confirmed any identity of these militants, uh, but Lashkar always has a you know, mixture of both the locals and as well as the people from across the border. Uh, so one has to wait and watch to really w who are these people, uh, but most probably there will be some local and there, there may be some uh, foreign militants also in this particular group, because most of these groups comprise of both foreign and mm -hmm. local, uh, but uh, we cannot say it uh, with all surety all right. right now. But uh, within an hour, the image will be pretty much clear that who are these people who have been killed in this particular encounter. All right. We'll have to leave it there. Thank you very much indeed, Ishan Vani, for joining us from Srinagar and getting these updates. We'll, of course, get back to you soon as there is more information that is available.